Hey guys and girls, in honor of the channel name change, I'm going to drop a new video today. This is my LC9S Pro with high-vis sights. This gun, I've had different ones. I've, I had the regular LC9 and the trigger pull was just horrible on it. I, I hated the trigger, but the LC9S... Even the, the EC9S, the only difference with those are the sights. But this gun right here, I don't think that you can find a better uh, small, compact EDC gun if you're not looking for a double stack. You know, if, this, if it's a single stack, either this or they have some uh, Glocks that are about this size things along those lines but this gun it does its job for me shootability wise i believe that you have to have this whole grip on here or at least a lot of grip tape i mean you can have this magazine with the with the pinky rest floor plate but i'd rather have the hoe grip with the flush mount it's just, it doesn't imprint as much and depends on how you carry it. But this is a perfect self-defense gun, in my opinion. It's very, very accurate. It shoots very tight groups, or at least I shoot very tight, gr tight groups with it. And I've gotten, I've gotten rid of like three of these. And I always find my way back to it. It's just one of those guns that... I get rid of and then I regret and then I have I end up replacing so I just keep all the accessories now if I ever was in a position to trade off or something like that because I'll know I want to replace it with another one eventually I was wanting to go through a couple of holsters I have for this I have this pocket carry holster the gun fits in there is nice retention and this hook right here clips on the corner of your pocket, whether it be your pants pocket or a jacket pocket. Maybe not in the weather we've been having lately. It's been We've been breaking records with this heat. But I like this holster. And then I have a Blade Tech holster right here. I like it also. But it's this part right here, it kind of digs into my side a little bit too much. So I end up using the universal holster that I have a video on also. I end up using it a lot more. And then when I'm wearing long pants or something, I have this little ankle holster right here. I like this one pretty good. And it has an extra mag holder, which I don't like. I don't use that part of it because it's just too much on the leg, too much weight on the leg. For this type of holster, I think the LCP would be a lot more perfect, but this gun is still very comfortable on it. I don't mind it at all. But I believe that this gun has a lot more kick than people think. People hear 9mm, they don't think it's a, a big bullet, or they don't think it's going to have as much recoil as it does. But if you shoot this gun with a flush mount, floor plate on the mag and no grip tape or hoe grip this thing has some kick to it so i would suggest if you have this gun get this hoe grip it's like it's not sponsored of course but it's like nine i think i paid nine or ten dollars for this grip and then there's no, not even a point in needing the, the pinky rest on the floor plate for me anyway but here it is lc oh you uh it doesn't have a slide release it's a slide catch and you do have to pull it back and do that but it's just a great all-around gun in my opinion they also have the lc's and this size but chambered in 380 i believe that like my girlfriend i believe that that's a perfect gun for her because she can shoot it a bunch and it not have as much recoil 
and a 380 will do the job most most people you know they they care about bullet size a lot too much and i care about bullet placement so here it is my little lc9s pro this come with uh high-vis sights this comes straight from ruger actually on a repaired gun a gun that couldn't be repaired so they sent me this little nice little thing because i told them that i love this gun ruger has excellent customer service i can't brag on that enough and great turnaround time also but this is one this is in my routine like in in my edc routine i feel very comfortable with this this gun they have nine and ten round mags also that you can get for it they come out about this far i didn't bring any out to the table to show but here it is guys go out and get you one if you are in the market for an edc that's pretty compact a single stack and i don't believe that you will have any complaints i believe you'll be very happy with this gun thanks uh for watching the video i'm gonna go plank on some steel and hopefully brew some steel up today and I appreciate you guys.